My name's Holly, and I am from Southeast Alaska. I'm a mama of two. I'm a wife, and I'm also a nurse. I've been a nurse for 11 years, and I love nursing. I love caring for patients, but I also have fallen in love with educating people on preventative health and wellness and really utilizing essential oils. When I started hospital nursing, like, this is it. This is who I am. I quickly realized, I think three years in, like, I can't do this for the rest of my life. My heart would feel so deeply. It was hard for me to detach at work and leave it at work and not bring it home with me. I, I care so much about people's stories and who and what they are. I was introduced to a lot of different oils before I was introduced to doTERRA, and so when I got introduced to doTERRA, I thought, oh, great, another essential oil. But I remember putting a drop of Breathe on, and I had been struggling with respiratory issues and getting sick chronically at the hospital, and I remember just putting it in my hand and breathing it in and feeling like, oh my word, my airways are open, this is amazing. I, I had never had the, the medicinal benefits before in using essential oils, and so I started to research, like, how are they sourced? Who, who checks this? Are they gonna... Are they going to show you what the results are of the testing? And I was just blown away that they're the only company in the essential oil industry that has the transparency of their testing and the integrity and the purity. I was never looking for doTERRA. I was never looking to do that. There's a lot of stigma behind it. And a lot of people think, Holly, like nursing has got science backing and doTERRA does not. That's wrong. There is thousands of journals now on PubMed and so um, we have the science there in the last 10 years. This isn't just like stuff that smells good. This is actually stuff that can yield amazing medicinal benefits and support your cells in a way that nothing else can. I think that my own journey of a lot of emotional healing and grieving and learning to walk through hard stuff has empowered and inspired me to want to uh, support others as they journey that and as they find their own emotional healing. The oils have been a powerful tool in that. I have grieved whether it was lost babies, lost friends. There was four years where we were losing babies and then did fertility treatments to have Sela that we didn't know if we'd have kids. And I remember just grieving my guts out in the fetal position. That process really birthed this passion like, man, you don't you don't get to just have this or take this for granted. Like this is the greatest privilege. Life is not guaranteed and you're not guaranteed tomorrow and you're not guaranteed to get what you want. I, I really see the injustice of our system and our society and how we just medicate, medicate and we put a bandaid on an issue but we're never treating the root issue. And so I love to support others to journey that hard place of dealing with the inner work so that they can live fully.